And we're back at the El Dorado here on the dining show with Greg Carano and I, and in the perfect location for eating sushi. Yeah, Sam. Welcome to Sushi Saki at the Roxy. Here at the El Dorado, we just opened it up, and we have our sushi chef, Kuhn. Kuhn, what's your last name? Uh, Chan Palazin. We'll stick with Kuhn. Kuhn, right <laughs> on, Kuhn. What, what are you making for the first one uh, here? This first roll is going to be a sage roll. A sage roll? Yeah, it's one of them. Uh, very popular right now. OK. OK, and uh, I'll show you how this thing done. And what kind of fish do you have on uh, here? We have a sea ahi. Sea ahi? Yes, sir. OK. Now. I love ahi. Me too. <laughs> Okay. Look at his knife skill there. Oh yeah, okay. yesterday I was in here um, practicing making some sushi. He goes, Greg, you look nervous. <laughs> he goes, your hand is really tense. I go, yeah, it's really tense because when you're cutting it, it's going right uh, towards your hand. So, so sorry, can well, I get the you want some? sauce? Here we go, we got the sage sauce. All right, here we are. This is the a house basil sauce. Uh, executive, executive chef making uh, this particular sauce. Troy make that? No. Uh, oh, Jaken. Yes. Jaken, the chef at the Roxy. Yes. Yes. Wow. We and sent Jaken to a sushi school down in LA a couple months ago. Okay. He came back. He didn't know anything about sushi. Came back making great sushi rolls and brought back some great ideas. And this is a sweet sauce on the top? Uh, teriyaki sauce. Yes. Uh, teriyaki sauce. Okay. Yes. And what's in the middle? Uh, it's a crab. The, that's a crab on the middle. Okay, crab. It's like okay. a crab salad, yeah? Yes, it is. So you crab with a little mayonnaise. Uh-huh. And then you got a uh, fried shallot here. Oh, fried shallots. Yes. You know, people don't use shallots enough at home. Oh, they're the best. Every chef this, is, uh, this is very tasty roll, so. Very uh, tasty roll. Yes, a little bit of uh, a green onion there. Look at that. That's right what it looks like. That's what it looks like, and this is what it tastes like. <laughs> there we go, Sam. This is what we do on the dining show. Sam and I eat. You good? It's very good. The thing that hits you first is the shallots. Mm. It's got a really nice flavor. Mm. With the fish, obviously, absolutely fresh and delicious. Mm. Very clean tasting. Mm. You know, we, uh, our fish we buy, it's uh, shipped in twice a week here. We buy the best of fish, all you can eat for lunch, $17.99, dinner, a couple dollars more. We have a happy hour, half off rolls. Tell them about half off rolls. This is from 5 to 6 p.m. 5 to 6, half off rolls and late night, 9 to 10. And as uh, it picks up, I'll continue just to raise that, um, that uh, late night to a later hour because um, what a great location. People come to the uh, Sushi Saki at the Roxy, and they come from Brew Brothers to Babinga's back open. We got a new bar down on the casino floor called Bar Central. So we get a lot of people coming down to have martinis at the Roxy. We have 25 different uh, uh, flavors of sake. And uh, I want to keep this place open later and later and have uh, Reno come down and uh, enjoy a little sushi, sake, and dancing at the El Dorado. Well, you know what else is really cool is your menus. Yeah. They're like iPads. Yeah, the and iPads. so people can go in there and take a look at their menu selections and then order them right here. Yeah, this you... is a great location for a sushi bar. And this is wonderful. This is wonderful, huh? So fresh.